story I was telling you yesterday. We were playing. We were playing in the barn at Uncle Ted's house. And Pat was a bit. Pat was a bit older than me by a few years. He was a teenager, and I was. I was. I don't know. Eight, something like that. No, no, you wasn't even that. I was five. Who knows? <laughs> you were three Six years old when we left Ohio. You could have been a more no, three years. No, no, you're not. Oh. This is a different story. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> we were we were playing in the barn, and Pat's there was this board laying there, and Pat said, "Hey, watch this!" And he started jumping up and down on the board, and underneath this board, all these yellow jackets came out flying. So we all took off running out of the barn, and I was the smallest one in probably the slowest one as well and I tripped and I fell and I got stung in the lip and I got stung in the back and I spent the evening in Uncle Ted's throwing up and everything else but I, I remember that I remember riding a horse I remember riding a horse with Pat too a pony and we would just tear off down the hill and he would take us as fast as we could go on that horse but uh, I will say this uh, when did you, when did Uncle Ted get the indoor plumbing? 1976? Was that 1976? All I know, I was really relieved because I was tired of the horse flies biting me in the outhouse. <laughs> <laughs> always, another thing was, um, Uncle Ted, he always kind of took care of us when we were there. They had a rooster, and he would always make a beeline to me. Mm. And I would just stand there, and I would just yell for Uncle Ted. And I, I truly believe that Uncle Ted could have been a field goal kicker with the NFL. <laughs> <laughs> he could, he'd kick that rooster, and that rooster would go higher than this. Whoa. And as soon as that rooster hit the ground, he would come straight running at me. And I took Uncle Ted maybe three or four kicks, but he finally could get it. <laughs> Well, kind of what Pat said, you know, my father, Dick Salib, Ted's brother's been gone for quite some time now, but I think you all know he was a, he was a load of fun to be around, um, played a lot of ball with us, he, uh, you know, I ran, was telling Dustin I ran my first marathon with him when I was 13 years old, mm -hmm. he was the kind of man that was more than willing to spend, spend plenty of time with his children. And uh, that's the legacy that you, that's the legacy that you leave. What, what you have and what you own in your houses, that's, that's nothing. What you have is your, your legacy is your time left with your children. Yeah. Mm -hmm.